everyone, it's Liddy. Welcome back to my channel. Today I received another liquidation order. I got some new stuff for my eBay store and I wanted to unpack it with you, get it all sorted out and show you guys what I got. Although full disclosure, I'm honestly not sure exactly what I'm opening today. Because here's the thing, I actually got two orders delivered at the exact same time and they are just a little bit different. And I don't know which one this is. Your guess is as good as mine. So this liquidation order came from Wholesale Ninjas. You guys always hear me talk about them on my YouTube channel. It's because they're my favorite place to get things like personal care and health and beauty. So the two different orders that I received today was one 500 count personal care lot with cosmetics and one 500 count personal care lot without cosmetics. So now there is a difference. Whenever you buy health and beauty or personal care from Wholesale Ninjas, you can order it one of two ways which is exactly what I did. I just got one of each. One has cosmetics in it and one has no cosmetics in it. The price difference is roughly a 40 cent price difference just depending. So without the cosmetics, it's roughly $1.92 per unit. And with the cosmetics is roughly $1.56 per unit. But one thing that is certain, I am very excited to get into these boxes because the last time you saw me unbox a personal care lot from Wholesale Ninjas, I had a little bit of a skincare gasm on camera. I really, really liked the personal care lot that I got last time. I'll make sure to link that unboxing down in the video description if you missed it. But I'm just gonna go ahead and start opening up these boxes and start pulling things out. I'll show you guys what I got. I do intend to have a lot of duplicates, so I'm really only going to be showing you the new items that I pull out of the box. If there's a bunch of duplicates, I will just kind of set them aside. That way the video doesn't get too long. But if you are interested in buying for your own business, from Wholesale Ninjas. They are a partner of my YouTube channel, so I do have a coupon code for them. The code is Lindy25, and it gets you $25 off of anything on the Wholesale Ninjas website. And here we go. All right, so right off the bat here, we got some mask bar hydrating face masks, as well as a Neutrogena Hydro Boost uh, Hydro Gel face mask, Garnier Skin Active Micellar Cleansing Eco Pads. Here's a Crayola Heart Bath Bomb, some simple compostable uh, cleansing wipes, two eight packs of Joy Refill uh, Razor Cartridges. We've got some toothbrushes here. We've got a Colgate 360 Charcoal Toothbrush. So I actually have a lot of success selling toothbrushes. I just lot them up be rather than just, you know, selling one single toothbrush I just do lots of them and here's two packs of Oral-B gum care compact toothbrushes there's a Vaseline vintage tin uh, lip balm there's a three-piece scrunchy animal print hair accessories Ooh, these are soft soft scrunchy sets uh, simple eye makeup remover pads got a couple of chapstick total hydration lip glosses with essential oils this one is grapefruit and lime and then we have an orange and lemon again I do love selling stuff like this in lots and there's the same thing here with some Burt's Bees same deal this so this Burt's Bees so these are tinted I actually found some that were the cocoa color I sold four of them for 50 bucks. No, no joke. I had like five or no, four of them. There was four of the cocoa ones I sold for 50 bucks overnight. So be on the lookout for colors that might've been discontinued. Some Burt's Bees Purely White Toothpaste, a Finishing Touch Flawless Hair Remover. So these are the Bevel. Uh, Bevel Men's Skin Care Hair Care. These are two beard balms. So the last time I had anything Bevel, they were this really, really small, like uh, ap not aftershave, but like skin care, these little tubes of skin care. I sold five of them for like 20 bucks and they were really, really tiny. So these are full size beard balms. I would suspect that these would be worth pretty good money. From the Beard Guys Beard Serum with Grotein. Okay, so here's some more face masks. M Skin Care After Element Sheet Mask. So there's a few varieties. Again, sheet masks are something that I always lot up together. I don't really sell singles. So here's a post-shave sheet mask. Uh, so this is obviously for men. And then After Element Sheet Mask for Calm and Rehydrating Stressed Skin. And then, yep, definitely for men. You could see a man demonstrating putting it on. Soothing your face after shaving. A Yes to Bubble Paper Mask. 
there's, let's see, five in here. So I would probably just sell them as is, five in a set. Oh, here we go. It's a Philips Norelco nose, ears, and brows trimmer. Brand new in the box. There's a couple uh, Mele, uh, you tell me, M-E-L-E, Mele Project Do the Most Sheer Moisturizer with SPF 30. Those look fancy. L'Oreal Men Expert Daily Moisturizer. So in my experience, men's facial moisturizers usually do pretty well and sell pretty fast because not a lot of people are selling them, I've noticed. There's not, there's, there's a whole bunch of women's facial moisturizers, but you don't really see men's a lot. There's another one. Ooh, here's another bevel. That bevel skincare, this one is face wash. Here's a wall all-in-one rechargeable groomer, brand new in the package. Ooh, here's some bliss. I really like seeing bliss. Uh, let's see, this is a four pack of Mighty Marshmallow. Uh, let's see, that's a whipped mask, what a melon, overnight mask, pumpkin powerhouse, enzyme mask, and green tea wonder clarifying overnight mask. So it's a four piece facial mask set. Ooh. I've sold this brand before, the AHC Aqualuronic Toner and Cleanser. I think the last time I had this, it was a toner. The bottle was a little bit bigger, but I want to say it sold for about $30. So this is a pretty fancy schmancy brand right here. So depending on how many of these I have, I might sell these as a set like this, do like one cleanser, one toner or I would just have separate listings if I have multiple quantities. Because anytime I can maximize my profit in one transaction, I wanna do that. And so if I can sell them together to get more profit in the transaction, then that's what I'll do. Okay, so here's three tubes and the box is kind of popped open, which is not a big deal, just close them back up again. Groom and Clean Greaseless Hair Control. So this looks like it's some sort of hair styling gel for men. Okay, we have some eye eye drops here. So this box unfortunately got a little bit smushed, so I'm going to have to mold it back into shape, but it's allergy relief, multi-action visine. And then I have some visine dry eye relief. And let's see another bevel. This one is an exfoliating toner. If I have a lot of a different, um, if I have a lot of different of these bevel products, I'll probably make like a custom lot and sell all of them together. If I've got like the toner and the face wash and some aftershave or something, I'll probably sell all of them together. Jolene Cream Bleach for women's facial hair. I'll see, here's another men's bevel shave system. This one is the Restoring Balm. Ooh, here's a Harry's Razor. Uh, Harry's Razors usually sell pretty darn quick for me. Native deodorant on the go deodorant trio set. Here's a men's ultra smooth fresh start deodorant. Again, deodorant is something I definitely sell in lots, so I'm hoping to find more in here. Here's some more of that men's M skincare. Looks like this is an acne control serum. There's one, two, three, four. Okay, so there's four of that one, and then there's a fifth one that's a replenish all day serum. We've got some Duke Cannon Cologne, Randolph. Ooh, I'll bet this one smells really good. Oh, so there are two different ones. So let's see, Randolph is bergamot, lavender, and leather. And then Grant is warm spice, tonka, and sandalwood. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so this brand, I've never had the, or wait, no, I have had the cologne before. It was like a, a trio gift set and they all sold out. So I have sold this brand of cologne before. So I'm happy to see that. Here's some more beard oil with Grotein by Beard Guys. There's another two in here. And then here's another one of the beard serums. So far, I'm really happy to see a lot of men care because I don't get a lot of men, uh, like men facial care or men products. Here's some more beard balm, especially when it's this bevel brand because this bevel brand has always done really well for me. So I'm very happy so far to see, uh, to see men's skincare. What I don't see here is cosmetics. So I'm thinking I might be opening a box that has no cosmetics in it. Here's some Olay body milk. Even though there's chapstick, this isn't technically, uh, this isn't technically cosmetics. This is more on the health side because it's lip balm and chapstick. Ooh. Here's probiotic, healthy tract, uh, digestive care, and dates are good. So anytime there are expiration dates, I always double check just to make sure they're not past date. Very rarely are they ever past date. So if I don't say anything about the expiration date, it just means it's because it's good. Ooh, we've got some 
Nice bar soaps here. We've got some Shea Moisture African Water and Mint Ginger Detox Shea Butter Soap. So again, this is something that I would sell in a lot together and you can save on shipping by shipping them in a priority flat rate envelope. Oh, here's some more of the Duke Cannon Cologne. Uh, they're both Prescott, which is Citrus, Oak Moss, and Tonka Cologne. Oh, here's another Shea Moisture uh, soap. It's Cannabis Sativa Hemp Seed Oil, which is for calm and comfort. Hopefully there are some more in these boxes so I can combine them all together. There's another cologne. Okay, so here's a couple more colognes. Oh my goodness, I like the colognes. Huron and Seneca. Ear Itch MD Nighttime, so it's for irritated ears. Some more Visine. Oh, I've sold this before. Uh, Dove Pampering Mango Butter Bar Soap. Some Pond's Micellar Water Rose Facial Wipes. Some Neutrogena Rapid Tone Repair Correcting Cream. Ooh, here we go. I saw this down here. A Bronze Silk Epple 3 Epilator. So it looks like it's brand new in the box. Still got its factory seal. So last time I sold these, they sold between $30 and $40. Ooh, what do we have here? We have some Yes To, uh, let's see, Oxygenated Foaming Cleanser. So these have little scrub brushes, so you squeeze it out and scrub it on your face. That's fun. <laughs> Here's a Nerf hand soap, hand sanitizer, and lip balm gift set. Got some Olay Cranberry Seed Exfoliating Face and Body Powder. Ooh la la. Ooh, here's some Pixie. I love seeing Pixie. Ooh, I've sold this before. Uh, Glow Tonic Serum and uh, Vitamin C Lotion. So I love selling Pixie Skin Care. It's a really, really popular item in my eBay store. So I'm always happy to see that brand. Here's some more of the Men's Lip Care. This is the Lip, uh, lip Mend Hemp Therapy Chapstick. Some Secret Clinical Strength Completely Clean Deodorant. I actually have this already listed so I can just add it, uh, add it in stock in my eBay store. Here's a couple of the Pinod Clubman Finest Powder. Uh, is this just a body powder? An ultra fine men's body powder. I believe that's what that is. Oh, let's see. We've got some, let's see, Glee Shave Mousse and we've got some Glee Shave Gel, some Pure Gillette Soothing Aloe Men's Shaving Gel, some Gillette Venus Olay Shaving Cream. There's another men's. And then again, there are multiples of things down here that I'm just pulling out if we've already seen it. Ooh, here's some Flonase 120 and a 60 meter spray. It's the perfect time of year to be selling allergy medicine, that's for sure. I myself could benefit from some Flonase. Some Dove Extra Fresh men bar soap. Ooh, here we go. So I've already sold a couple of these six packs of the Nexus dry shampoo mist. And let's see, we've got some Shea Moisture Quench and Refresh body scrub. So here's a Master Case three pack, and this is probably exactly how I would sell it. I would just sell three all together and ship it in a flat rate envelope. So here's something else I've already listed and sold. I just need to go replenish it now. It's the Olay Luminous Miracle Boost Concentrate Skin Cream. So in the last personal care video, I got a whole bunch of Olay and I can see that there's still a few Olay products in this newest order just kind of trickling down from the last time I got some. Oh, darn it. I thought this was the, <laughs> I thought this was the cocoa. So excited there for a minute. No, this one is fig. This one is the fig, but the cocoa was very, very close to this color. But again, these Burt's Bees lip shimmers, be on the lookout for colors that might've been discontinued. Cause like I said, I sold four for 50 bucks of that cocoa color. All right, and then we've got, so in these boxes in here, Wholesale Ninjas always, which I appreciate more than I could express, Anything that can leak, they pack in separate boxes like this so that it doesn't get all over everything in case something breaks during transit. So that's what these boxes are. But these two boxes look like they are case packs of some kind. So I'm gonna open these up so we can see what it is. So this one, it's a simple hydrating light moisturizer. So that's, oh, I actually already have these listed. It's these fun little packs of simple facial moisturizer. So this is just a case pack of those. There's 12 in here. So this is something I already have listed. So just go add a quantity to it. This is Yes To Coconuts Restoring Body Balm. So let's take a look and see. 
what this is exactly. But whenever you guys hear me talk about Wholesale Ninjas, how I always mention that it's like getting wholesale for a liquidation price, this is exactly what I'm talking about. If you were to spend a whole bunch of money on wholesale, this is the kind of stuff you would be getting right here because this is brand new. This is still, this is like direct from distributor, master case packed kind of stuff. So these are head to toe restoring balms. Yes, two coconuts. So there are six in here, but I paid a liquidation price for this. So that's one of the reasons why I'm always talking about Wholesale Ninjas as being one of my favorite places to get personal care from because it's literally wholesale quality product but you're paying for it like it was liquidated and it's customer returns. And you might expect to get a whole bunch of expired and broken crap because it's all liquidation, but it's not. It's wholesale quality, which is why I absolutely love getting this kind of merchandise from them. All right, so let's see what kind of leaky stuff we got. Oh, here we go. See, everything is all bagged up just in case it leaks. I think I opened this box upside down though. All right, so we've got, ooh, Olay deep sea kelp b3 complex body wash i do feel like something might have leaked in this box oh no okay time to roll up the sleeves <laughs> i think something might have leaked which again i'm glad that they package it separately yep so there's a little bit of a leak here except that might be something i don't think this is it okay so yep so we've got just a little bit of leak but it's no big deal we'll just literally run it under the water and wipe it down that's all i have to do let's see here some olay cleansing infusion crushed ginger body wash old spice ultra smooth fresh start body wash some irish spring black mint body wash, some Dove Pure Puring Detox with green clay body wash. Oh my goodness, if you guys have never used, if you're a lady that shaves your legs and you've never tried this Gillette Venus Shower and Shave, oh, every single variety. This is the Freesia, but I really like the um, uh, the Shea Butter one. Oh my gosh, this is the best shave cream in the world. <laughs> I love this shave cream. Ooh, here's a J.R. Watkins foaming hand soap. This one is lavender. Here's some Olay rinse off body conditioner. Here's another one. Here's another men's ultra smooth body wash. Here's a men's Gillette smoothing shave cream. Here's a Cetaphil moisturizing cream. Uh, Harry's face wash, some Vanderhagen or Vanderhagen self heating shave cream. There's another one. Here's another Harry's face wash. And then the last thing in here is a little travel size Cetaphil body and face moisturizing lotion. We got a cute little set over here. Okay, so that's it for those. I'm gonna stick all of these back in here cause I do need to run these under the water just to kind of rinse them off, but it does not feel like anything has leaked so significantly to where I can't sell it. So what I'll do is I will just lot up similar things and sell them in lots. And then I usually ship those in like a regional A box because they won't typically fit in a flat rate envelope and a padded flat rate envelope, stuff like that, I don't necessarily trust. So I usually do a regional A box for that kind of stuff. And I just uh, do lots, like maybe two, three or four bottles of something. All right, so now here's one more. Okay, so here's some more similar stuff that I can add to that other box. We've got more of the Vanderhagen, the deep sea kelp body wash. Here's a Garnier Aqua Boost uh fresh mix sheet mask it's another jr watkins foaming hand soap this one is ocean breeze more olay the rinse off body conditioner a couple more of the pure gillette soothing uh, skin shave cream another ocean breeze there's a couple bottles of cetaphil daily facial cleanser oh here's a Dove Instant Foaming Body Wash. There's, let's see, the mango butter and then the cucumber and green tea. Another hand soap. Here's some Shea Moisture Energizing Bubble Bath and Body Wash. Oh, there's another one of those uh, creamy shave creams. Oh, there's another one. So I've got a three pack. So I'll probably list all three of those together. And then two more of the Old Spice Body Wash and then one L'Oreal Expert. I think I've already sold this before. Extreme Cleanser with Charcoal. And so then that is what is all out of that box. We still have two more boxes to go. Okay, here's the second box. Hopefully this one doesn't have cosmetics because 
for sure the last box that we opened is not part of the one with cosmetics so hopefully i didn't mix boxes up and i kept everything with the same order okay so right off the top i see a bunch of stuff we've already seen already so i'm just gonna pull those off and get to the stuff we haven't yet seen So as I'm going through here and I'm pulling out stuff that I've already shown you guys from the last box, I'm just thinking to myself, everything is so consistent. Like I'm just looking here and I just see everything that I've sold before and I sell it consistently. So that makes me very, very happy to see the fact that I'm seeing items that I'm used to selling and I can almost foresee exactly how long it's going to take me to list, how long it's going to take me to sell them. So I love the consistency of these boxes for sure. Okay, so I pulled off a lot of stuff off the top. So let's take a look and see what we've got here. So, oh, okay, so this one, this, so this is considered damage. So Wholesale Ninjas always ask for a 5% variance for damage. So this is the first thing I've seen that's really this kind of damage. This is definitely not new. It looks like it has been opened the the dental guard has been removed so this is just going straight into the trash i don't like getting that kind of stuff but it does happen occasionally conair quick smooth little travel hairspray some scrunchy headbands there's a couple of speed sticks here's one irish spring original and one fresh scent stain guard there's a couple more toothbrushes that i can set aside to lot up there's some oral b and some more colgate here's a cvs uh, CVS brand blade for men four blade disposable uh, disposable razors here's a Conair standard view every day I'm hustle and compact I think I already have some of those listed so I can just add those to the quantity here's some sm oh smile direct club for real smile direct club premium toothpaste so it's for cavities and whitening, premium fluoride toothpaste. That is awesome. And yes, there is an expiration date. A lot of people don't realize that toothpaste has expiration dates, but they do, but these don't expire till 2022. So we're good on that. Sally Hansen wax strips. So they're Insta wax strips. We've got some Colgate hemp seed oil toothpaste. What? Hemp seed oil with peppermint oil. That is interesting. All right, what we got here? We've got some more pixie. Love the pixie. We've got some, ooh, under eye vitamin C brightener. And then here's a vitamin C brightening perfector. And what's this one? Collagen lip gloss. Hello. Some botanical collagen lip gloss. Oh my gosh, there's lots of, oh, there's lots of pixie in here. Okay, so here's the H2O skin drink with aloe vera and green tea. More of the brightening perfector. He, oh, I've sold this before. This is the Pixie Skin Treats Peel and Polish with Lactic Acid and Papaya. Here's a Retinol Jasmine Facial Lotion. Here's another one of the H2O Skin Drink. Oh my goodness, look at all the Pixie Beauty. <gasps> look at all the Pixie Beauty. I love Pixie Beauty, you guys. Oh my gosh. Oh, this makes me so happy. Some more Visine. So this brand, this uh, this variety of Visine actually sells the best for me. It's the the Red Eye Hydrating Comfort. This one always sells the best. Uh, there's a lot of different varieties of Visine, but that one is by far the bigger seller for me. Let's see. Here's ooh, I have these listed too from the from the last order I got. Um, they've all sold out but now I can replenish the stock because I just leave everything out of stock and then I just add a quantity when I get more in. It's the Olay Luminous Light Hydrating Facial Lotion. There's a Chapstick Classic Cherry Lip Set with a bonus stick of the moisturizer. Secret Cucumber Water Invisible Solid Deodorant. So here's a Beard Guys Beard Balm. We haven't seen that one yet. Ooh, there's another epilator in here. Woo! Love seeing a second one of those. Ooh, and here's another one of the, the AHC Hydrocolonic Cleanser. Here's an Aveeno Calm and Restore Triple Oat Serum. Here's another one of those Healthy Tract Dietary Supplements. Oh, here we go. Oh, but this is just a little baby pack. Womp, womp, womp. I'll probably just keep these for myself. Uh, it's just some Claritin chewables. 
Uh, there's only four in here, so I don't really think that there's value in selling it. Well, I mean, there's a couple of boxes. If I had a bunch of boxes, I'd probably sell them all together, but I don't really know that people are only buying boxes with four tablets. These are almost like a like a trial or a travel pack, so I'll probably just keep these for myself. Visine Dry Eye Relief, there's another variety. Okay, so here's some more facial wipes. So we already saw the Pond's Brightening ones, but this is the Pond's uh, vitamin micellar hydrate with aloe vera facial wipes. Here's a Schmidt's coconut lime toothpaste. Ooh, here's a Veet three-in-one ready-to-use wax strip kit. All right, there's some more shave creams down here. Just gonna pull all these bad boys out. Again, shave creams are something that I sell in lots. It's not really worth it to sell them individually, but when you can group them together, that's when it really makes it worth the profit. Here's a Rose Skip the Spa Hydrating Rose and Charcoal Face and Body Bar Soap. Ooh, 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 I've sold these before. Gillette Clinical Clear Gel Power Rush Men's Deodorant. Bar soap, so I'm just gonna lot all of those up together. Ooh, there's some more Pixie, the collagen lip gloss. Oh, here's another case pack. It's the Yes Chew Coconuts uh, Balm. There's another case pack of those. Dove makes bath bombs? I didn't know Dove made bath bombs. Rose water and white chocolate and vanilla raspberry creamsicle. Oh my God. I can smell them through the packaging. Oh, oh yeah. Here's another Schmidt's Winter Mint Toothpaste. Oh, here's another Philips Norelco Nose, Ears, and Brows Trimmer. There's another case pack of the, the Simple Moisturizer Pouches. Okay, and then what's left in this box are the leaky stuff. They're the boxes full of the leaky stuff. So let's see what's in here. It's probably probably a lot more duplicates of the other leaky kind of stuff we saw. Indeed it is. So we've got more of the J.R. Watkins foaming hand soap, uh, more of the Dove foaming body wash, more of that Venus Olay shave cream, the Olay body conditioner. Oh, oh no, there's something on it though. Uh oh, <laughs> there's something on here. This is the, the Pixie Botanical Collagen Tonic. Whatever is on this, it smells really, really good though. I need something to wipe this with. Oh my goodness. Yeah, something leaked. I don't know what it is. I think it's, yep, it was this. It was this, see? Yep, every once in a while during transit, something jostles loose and then something, it doesn't look like it broke. It looks like it just twisted. It's that Olay Rinse Off Body Conditioner. Oh my gosh, it smells really good though. I might just have to keep this to try for myself because it smells so darn good. Um, but yeah, so it just it just kind of leaked on here. Just wipe it off, that's it. That's, I don't even consider that damage because it's like, well, it's ready to sell now and it's pixie. There's some more of the Gillette Pure. There's a couple of those. Here's another uh, Dryness Relief Dove Body Wash. More Olay Body Washes to add to the other ones from the previous box. There's a Garnier Skin Active Clean Blackhead Removing Scrub more Old Spice, another Harry's face wash. There's another Cetaphil set, but this one uh, got some of the Olay on it, so I just need to rinse it off. Another one of the Olay rinse off body conditioner, a hydrating glow Olay body wash, and another L'Oreal men's facial cleanser with charcoal. And then there's one more little box in here. Probably gonna be a lot more of the same stuff, but let's take a peek. Ooh, okay. Well, there's some different stuff in here, actually. We've seen that before, the Aqua Boost Fresh, Miss, uh, Fresh Mix Facial Mask. Some more of the Vanderhagen, Vanderhagen. Here's a Sport Care Dove Men Care Endurance and Comfort Micro Moisture Body Wash. Body Wash, got a hiccup there. Here's a Hemp's Triple Moisture Body Wash. So this, this Hemp's brand, so I sell a lot of the lotion, but I did not know that they made a moisturizing body wash. I bet this smells fantastic. The lotion smells really, really good. Ooh, here's another Pixie Retinol Jasmine. This one is the cleanser. Ooh, here's some more hemp's. Ooh, I'm gonna sell these as a set. I'm gonna sell these as a set. These are all body washes. I'm selling these exactly like that. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. And I'm gonna ship them in a flat rate envelope to save on shipping. There's the Age Defy Body Scrub Original Herbal Body Wash and then a Triple Moisture Body Wash. A lot more goodies that we've seen before. All that's left in this box that we haven't seen before is this Sally Hansen After Scare Smoothing Lotion and then a 
Tom's Prebiotic Moisturizing Hand Soap, which I have already sold before. So I already have a listing created for that. And then that is everything that is in this box. There is one more box to go. All right, and this is box number three. For the first time, I realized I actually saved the smallest one for last. So usually the smallest one has a lot of little stuff in it. Like in the past, the smaller boxes usually will have uh, a couple bags of cosmetics in it or some hair accessories or things like toothpaste or toothbrushes or chapsticks. A lot of the smaller stuff usually comes in here. Um, and I don't see any cosmetics. So I think on the first score, I actually managed to get the right box. <laughs> I got all three boxes with the same order. Go me. Okay, so again, I see a lot of duplicates. So I'm just gonna pull those out because we've already talked about them so we can get to the stuff that you guys haven't seen yet. Because remember, I, there's 500 total units here. So I can't possibly show you everything because we will be here all day long. But I am loving the fact that I have so many duplicates of things that I've already shown you guys because the more duplicates I have, that means that the more quantities I have, the bigger lots I can make and like stuff like this. I love selling this kind of stuff in lots because it's super duper lightweight and I can really maximize that profit. And I couldn't do that if I only had one or two, but because I've counted like eight of these so far, I will be able to make a couple of different lots of those. And it's always nice to be able to create like one listing and then have multiples that you can sell. It's like you keep getting profit on the same listing over and over and over again. Ooh. Yeah. And it's stuff that's consistent sellers for me. There's duplicates of all of it. Like look, more duplicates of Olay. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love selling this kind of stuff, you guys. For real, for real. Let's see, so here's a blade premium grooming comb. Degree clinical protection motion sense deodorant. Here's a Pons Skin Tightening Serum. So Pons is another one of those brands I really, really, really like seeing. I sell a ton of Pond's face cream, a ton of Pond's facial wipes, and I've never before sold the skin tightening cream by Pond's, but every facial serum I ever sell sells really, really quick. So I know that Pond's probably makes a quality product and they probably have a very, very loyal following. Uh, same thing here is a Pond's Advanced Hydrating Night Cream. Here's, ooh, this looks like a box with multiples. There's two bottles of the Visine Allergy Eye Relief. Here's a travel size of the Gillette Fusion 5 Sensitive Skin uh, Shave Cream or shave gel rather. Um, I've been seeing a lot of comments on my YouTube channel about Wholesale Ninjas and uh, uh, travel size stuff. And one of the things that I wanted to point out was yes, travel size stuff is a part of getting these lots, but do not underestimate being able to sell travel sizes. Think about people that have things like Airbnbs. Think about people who travel a lot for work. They need to have a lot of this kind of stuff on hand. And if you can sell it in lots online, they're more likely to buy in bulk from sellers like us versus having to go to the store and pay a markup every time they need it. But the biggest person that we can market to are the people that do things like Airbnb and rent out space in their homes. I know that they buy a lot of that kind of stuff. So don't think that just because you get travel size stuff that it still won't sell. Just bulk it all up together and sell it in a giant lot. Oh, here we go. There's another epilator. That means that there was an epilator in every single box. I tell you, before I started liquidation, I didn't even know what an epilator was. And when I found out how much they sell for, I always look for epilators in my liquidations now, for sure. There's another Visine Totality Multi-Symptom Eye Relief. All right, so here's a bag of, so again, here's some more travel sizes. These are the Cremo Shave Cream, the Bulldog Face Wash, and a Bulldog Moisturizer. So the Bulldog Facial Wash or Moisturizer, I would probably sell together as a lot. Some Listerine Ready Tabs. These are eight tablets. So I had a lot of success when I had a whole bunch of these that I got in liquidation. I sold them in lots of like four, five, six, seven, eight, just depending on how many I had. And they actually sold pretty well. I was surprised. Okay. So again, I'm just kind of pulling out stuff we've already seen before. Ooh, more Olay, more Olay. Oh, here's a My Little Pony 
hand sanitizer, hand soap, and lip balm gift set. More Bevel Pond's Night Cream. Ooh, here's some more beard serum. Ooh, more cologne too. Ooh, more pixie, more pixie. So this box, I didn't have a lot of Olay, but I had stuff like Pond's and Pixie, which makes me just as happy. Oh, I say that though, and then there's some more Olay. There's some more Neutrogena. Uh, this one is the Bright Boost. This is an overnight recovery cream. <gasps> This is what got me so excited in the last personal care unboxing. It was this Olay Pro X brand. So this is the under eye restoration complex. I already have a listing created for that. So I can just add another quantity and sell more. All right, so lots of stuff we've already seen down here. So I'm kind of getting to the bottom of this here. Here's a couple secret coconut oil and mandarin essential oils deodorant. Oh, here's a Harry's gift set. So it's got a body wash, shave gel, razor, and uh, two five blade cartridge refills. So that's a nice little set and it'll ship really, really nicely. You could just slide it into a poly bag because it's already in a box protecting everything. So you just need to cover it with a poly bag and that's easy peasy shipping on that. The last thing in this box, so that's it for that. The last thing in here is a Harry's Harry's Master Case Pack. Let's see, it's body wash, Redwood body wash. Oh, here we go. So this, I have sold these before. Um, I didn't sell the Redwood, but I sold Stone. Stone was the one I sold. Um, I sold in a three pack like this. I sold Stone, a three pack of Stone for like $40. So very happy to see these. And there's two sets of three. This is exactly how I would sell it. I would just sell groups of three like this and I would ship them in a flat rate envelope or a regional A box. That's it. So that is everything that was in that set of three boxes. I have three other boxes that I need to unpack still, but that's going to be on a different video later on. Again, Wholesale Ninja is killing it with the consistency. There's lots of variety here. I got men's skincare. I got razor cartridges. I got shave gel. I got cologne. I got body care. I got scrubs. I've got body wash. I've got so many different consistent sellers. I am really excited for all of this. I'm really secretly hoping that I have a lot of duplicates in that other order because that's just going to mean that I can get all of the stuff listed and on eBay even faster if I have even more duplicates of the exact same thing. That's kind of one of the reasons why I received two orders at the same time hoping I could get a whole bunch of duplicates. So stay tuned and wait for that next video so you could see if I got a bunch of duplicates of what you just saw in this video today. But again, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video and videos like it, please do give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. If you're interested in seeing more videos about reselling merchandise on eBay, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them down in the comments below. Also, don't forget to check the video description. I will put a lot of useful information in there for you, as well as the coupon code if you want to try a lot from Wholesale Ninjas. Thank you guys again so much for watching. I will see you with my next video. Bye-bye.